Hey Space Explorers, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving headfirst into the cosmic ocean to uncover some of the most incredible and mind-bending facts about our universe. Look up at the night sky. It seems calm, eternal, maybe even a little understood. But the truth is, we are living inside the greatest detective story of all time. The universe is filled with profound, unanswered questions that challenge the very limits of our knowledge. For all that we've discovered, some puzzles are so deep, they keep the world's sharpest minds guessing. Today, we're diving into four of the biggest unsolved mysteries of the universe. These are the questions that, when answered, could rewrite our understanding of reality itself. Let's start with something holding our own galaxy together. Back in the 1970s, astronomer Vera Rubin was studying the rotation of galaxies. She expected the stars on the outskirts to move slower than the stars near the center, just like the outer planets in our solar system orbit slower than the inner ones. It's basic gravity, right? But that's not what she found. The stars on the edge were moving just as fast as the ones closer in. This was bizarre. It was like watching a merry-go-round where the horses on the outer edge were keeping pace with the ones in the middle. The only way this could happen is if there was a huge amount of invisible mass, a massive halo of something creating extra gravity. We call this mysterious stuff dark matter. It doesn't emit, absorb, or reflect any light, so we can't see it directly. But we know it's there. Its gravitational effects are seen everywhere, from single galaxies to the way entire galaxy clusters are held together. Here's the mind-blowing part. Calculations suggest dark matter makes up about 27% of the universe. All the normal matter, the stuff that makes up you, me, the stars, and planets, is less than 5%. So what is it? The leading theory is that it's made of undiscovered subatomic particles, nicknamed WIMPs, or weakly interacting massive particles. Scientists have built incredibly sensitive detectors deep underground, shielded from cosmic rays, to try and catch one of these elusive particles. So far, nothing. Dark matter remains a ghost, a massive, invisible scaffold for our cosmos that we are yet to formally meet. Okay, from the ghost that holds things together, let's move to a vanishing act from the dawn of time. According to our best theories of physics, the Big Bang should have produced matter and its evil twin, antimatter, in equal amounts. An antimatter particle is identical to its matter counterpart, but with an opposite charge. A negatively charged electron has a positively charged twin called a positron. The problem is when matter and antimatter meet, they annihilate each other in a flash of pure energy. So, if they were created in equal measure, the early universe should have been a cosmic war zone where everything annihilated everything else, leaving behind nothing but a sea of light. But look around. We exist. Galaxies, stars, planets, us, we are all made of matter. So, the great mystery is, where did all the antimatter go? Why is there this fundamental imbalance? Was there a slight asymmetry right at the beginning? For every billion antimatter particles, there were a billion and one matter particles? Or is there some unknown process that favors matter over antimatter? We simply don't know. The fact that you're here to watch this video is proof of this cosmic imbalance. But the cause remains one of the most fundamental puzzles in physics. Look into a question that feels a little more personal. Are we alone in the universe? Our galaxy, the Milky Way, contains an estimated 100 to 400 billion stars. And there are perhaps 2 trillion galaxies in the observable universe. Many of these stars have planets orbiting them. The numbers are so staggering it feels statistically inevitable that life, and even intelligent life, should have evolved elsewhere. This leads us to a famous question posed by physicist Enrico Fermi back in 1950. If the odds are so high, he asked, 
Where is everybody? This is the Fermi Paradox. Think about it. The universe is 13.8 billion years old. Earth is only 4.5 billion years old. There has been ample time for other civilizations to arise, develop, and even master interstellar travel. A civilization just a few million years older than us could have colonized the entire galaxy by now. Yet, when we listen with our radio telescopes, we hear nothing but cosmic silence. So what's the answer? There are many unsettling possibilities. Is intelligent life incredibly rare? Do civilizations inevitably destroy themselves before they can reach the stars? Is the universe a cosmic graveyard? Or maybe they are out there, but they're deliberately hiding from us. Or perhaps the distances are just too vast to ever cross. Whatever the answer, the silence is deafening. Finally, let's journey to the most extreme objects in the cosmos, black holes. We know what they are. Objects so dense that their gravitational pull is inescapable once you cross a boundary called the event horizon. But the unsolved mystery is what happens to stuff after it crosses that point of no return. Our two best theories of the universe completely break down here. Einstein's theory of general relativity predicts that all the matter collapses into an infinitely dense point called a singularity. But our other great theory, quantum mechanics, which governs the world of the very small, says that information can never be destroyed. So which is it? If you fall into a black hole, is all the information that makes you you crushed out of existence violating quantum mechanics? Or does something else happen? Does it get scrambled and radiated back out over trillions of years as Hawking radiation? Or, or does it lead somewhere else entirely? Maybe another universe? We can't see past the event horizon. The laws of physics as we know them cease to apply. A black hole is where our understanding of reality ends and pure mystery begins. Dark matter, missing antimatter, cosmic silence, and the secrets of black holes. These aren't just trivia questions. They are fundamental gaps in our knowledge of everything. But the beautiful thing about science is that every mystery is an invitation. An invitation to explore, to question, and to push the boundaries of human imagination. The answers are out there, waiting in the starlight. Thanks for joining this journey into the unknown. If this video sparked your curiosity, hit that like button and subscribe for more cosmic explorations. What unsolved mystery fascinates you the most? Let me know in the comments below. Until next time, stay curious.